Welcome to Your Questions Answered. I'm Jason, the Wizard of Ops. In each episode, I will answer one of your questions about Volink, my options dealer positioning dashboard. Brett R22 asks, how do I use the cumulative charm charts in Volink? First, if you're not familiar with how to use the cumulative charts, I would recommend starting there with my Discover Voland episode all about these charts. Second, I would recommend continuing with my Discover Voland episode about charm. In this video, I talk about the practical use of charm and what charm means. But let's dive a little deeper. First, I point out that total charm represents the changes in notional delta from one day passing. That means negative charm is bullish and positive charm is bearish. The value matters as well. However, what Brett is wondering is if the cumulative chart matters as much since all we need to do is account for the extremes in the chart to determine the total charm. So I will explain why the cumulative charm chart is displayed as it is. Remember that charm values have different signs depending on where price is. That is, a short put out of the money is negative charm since the positive deltas trend towards zero as time passes but a short put in the money trends toward 100 as time passes and is therefore positive charm. If price passes over that strike, the charm impact of that strike can flip from bullish to bearish or vice versa. With that in mind, let's look at the SPX charm chart for February 16th. In the beginning of the day, you can see aggregate charm is negative with negative 2 billion below the price with positive 500 million above giving a net charm of negative 1.5 billion. But let's say price drops below that 40-50 strike, which is the first drop to negative 500 million. That does not mean that charm adds negative 500 million. It is quite the opposite. That 500 million moves from negative to positive impact. The charm impact moves from negative 1.5 billion to negative 500 million. Of course, in real life, charm is more dynamic than that, but for illustrative purposes, this is how to read the cumulative chart for charm. Join my Discord group and ask any questions you may have about Volin. I may select yours to answer in my next video. Thank you for watching this video, and may Volin help you find success in the future.